How's it going everyone? Welcome to another GeoGuessr video. This time I am taking on the Improved World Hedge Streak. The goal of this category is to get as many games in a row with 20,000 points as you can, and of course it gets its name from hedging your bets. If you're not sure of a region within a country, especially a large one, you have to hedge to try to get as many points as possible. If memory serves me right, I haven't actually ever made a video about this category on the channel. We've attempted it on my Twitch channel a few times, but never for a video, but I was recently reminded of the category by Lupus, who made an incredible video about it just the other week. I cannot recommend recommend that video enough, by the way. It talks all about this category and really is just a love letter to GeoGuessr, so go give that a watch. I'll have a link in the description. Let's get some games of this category going here now. The category was changed so that there's a two minute time limit per round. It used to be unlimited, but they had to change it. Lupus's video talks a lot about why that's the case, but here we go with our first game. Let's see if we can get close to the solo record. Okay, this is a great first location to get here. I'm going to try to go relatively quickly through these just to get as many in as you can, but this is going to be Bolivia. This is a really distinct road in Bolivia this white Google car as well. We got a Bolivian pole. And yeah, I think it's, it might actually be farther east, like maybe this section, but somewhere along there. Yeah, not bad. Okay, that's a good start. So essentially, you need to average 4,000 points or more per round, and you will get 20k. Next round, we go right from that just to Russia here. Okay, oh, I, I want to go more south and west just with the wintery coverage, so hopefully that's not terrible. Yeah, there we go, 4k, awesome. Round number three. So far, this is going pretty well for the first attempt. This, I think, is going to be Portugal with these trees. The road, I feel like that fits. Yeah, those houses are very Portuguese. White with orange roofs, so we should be... I don't know, just somewhere in there. We should get enough points. Oh, it's Spain, okay. <laughs> now, the nice thing about head streaks is it doesn't matter if you get the country wrong as long as you are over 20k points in the end. That is what counts here. So here's round number four here. We're doing pretty good. This is a weird trekker. Oh, I don't recognize this. Oh, weird. Is this one of the American Samoa trekkers? It might be. I, I gotta just go for it, because we don't have too much time to spend thinking about it. Yeah, I don't... I don't know if it's the main island or what it is, but... Oh, it's this one. Oh, cool. I don't think I've ever had a round there. That's really interesting. But last round here, we are surely gonna get the 20k, I hope. I hope I didn't speak too soon. This is gonna be Canada. I've had this location before. Ah, oh, where was it? Oh, I might actually mess this up. Oh, no. <laughs> was it Newfoundland? Or, like... Maybe it was the new Labrador coverage? I feel like it's somewhere out here. It was the new Labrador coverage. Okay, but that's fine. We got 38, so our head streak is at 1. So for this video, I only have the head streak counter on, not the country streak, because again, it doesn't really matter, like the Spain-Portugal round, what countries we guess here, as long as we get the points. Here we go with game number 2. Let's keep it up. So far, pretty good game. Oh, I thought that wasn't going to load for a second. Okay, this is the US, and we're in Arizona, so plonking middle Arizona should get us 4K. Yeah, that's good. All right, next one, Australia. Oh, you guys know I struggle. The area codes as well could help me if I knew anything. Actually, no, this is New Zealand, so 03 actually does help. Oh, is that Auckland? I, it might just be Auckland or Hamilton. No, it's none of the above. It's Christchurch. Okay, <laughs> I just don't know anything about New Zealand. Uh, now I think we're actually in Australia, and this is really interesting. We got water out to the east here and a South Australian pole. Okay, glad that we see that, so... I guess maybe I go in one of these towns like that. That works for me. That's well over 4K. Next one. Oh, beautiful. This is Singapore. Really distinct signs here all throughout the country. And of course, you really want to get these small places. That is ideal here. So excellent to get that. Really lucky. And last round, let's try to stay above the 20K again. Oh, what is this? Is it Mexico pools? No, 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 no. That's very Thai architecture. I don't know why that looked like a hexagon, octagon to me, but no, this will be Thailand. It's more, more north, but we should be okay, as long as it's Thai. It's way south, but yeah, we survived with just over 400 left. So far, so good here with our streak. I think the solo third place is maybe 17 or something like that. Don't know exactly. I'll put it up on screen, but this one's going to be Malaysia. It looks like the peninsula side. Very distinct road lines here. And yeah, this this foliage and everything, the poles. So we're going to go right in there. Sarawak and Saba poles. Okay, maybe I should have known that. Next one is Colombia. So Colombia is one where maybe we can just plonk the middle. I, I'm not sure, because if it's not super close, like if it's way up here. Nah, I'll just plonk middle here. Yeah, that's good, okay. 45, yeah, Colombia, I think, is safe to go middle. Here is Indonesia, if you couldn't tell from the flags. Anything on here, we gotta make sure. I don't recognize anything on there. Yeah, I don't know, this kind of just feels like standard Java, maybe Sumatra, but... Yeah, i probably just go close to Bandung or something here. Indonesia is rough to get, it's absolutely huge. I'm not the greatest at it either, so this is where I could drop some points. And good, it is just Java. A little under 4k, but that's alright. We're still averaging just about okay. 
Next one, ah, oh, we're getting the big countries here. This should be Argentina. Ooh, okay. So how do we do this? Probably gonna be just somewhere in this area, just looking at the, the trees and everything, but you can't say for sure. Could be in a tough spot here. If we don't get the 4K, there's a good chance that we won't have enough points for round five, even if we 5K that round. I'm worried. I'm gonna go like right there, and hopefully that's not terrible. Ah, 37. Are we having enough points? We do have enough points, but we have to have a good guess here. Okay. Last round. Looks like we're somewhere in... Ah, what is this? Oh, no. Not a, not a good round to get here. This is not what you want to see. Should be somewhere in Latin America, but I can't really tell what the poles are. Is this Ecuador? Maybe it's Ecuador. Oh, the pressure's on here, and the time limit as well. Time is ticking down. If it's Ecuador, that's okay. I think going over here should get us enough points. If it's not Ecuador, we're screwed. So what else can this be? Is it Mexico? I just wish these poles were closer. Oh, what is that? I can't tell. I can't tell. I mean, it doesn't really strike me as Mexico very much, but I wouldn't be surprised, you know, if it's somewhere like over here. I really should know this. I'm gonna go Ecuador, and hopefully this isn't a terrible guess, but hey, we'll see. Sometimes it happens. And it is, thank god. Okay. Oh, we survived there. That was risky with a couple not-so-great guesses over in Southeast Asia. But we are alive with a head streak of three so far. Doing pretty well, man. I'm happy with this. Round number four. Let's go. Geo guesser load. Okay, it's coming. Slowly. Here it is. Alright, what do we got? This is Europe. Oh, is that one of those new Germany signs? I, I can actually see Germany here. Germany is on Improved World. Huge shout-out to Wolf Trucker for keeping this map up to date. And yeah, I think that's one of the signs you'll see in Germany. I I might be misremembering, but Middle Germany, hopefully that's a 4K. Oh, it's not. It's it's Belgium, but that's still 4K, so that's all right with me. Whatever, man. Next round here. Oh, what is this? Sun is in the north. Wow. Is this South Africa? I mean, it does look like we're... Yeah, we are driving in the left. That's the back of the car. Yeah, okay. Yeah, Sun in the north, driving left like this. It should be. I don't know if I go, like, over here, or what I do, really, on this. This is tricky. This kind of landscape, definitely not my strongest here. I, yeah, I guess, I guess just go there. Hopefully that's not terrible. Okay, that works. That's good. Okay. South Africa actually isn't as bad as I thought it would be. Next one is Australia again. Not South Australia poles, but this really reminds me of Perth, or, like, just West Australia. And we do have yellow signposts. Yes, okay, that is a West thing. So, what do we do here? Because west is pretty big, if it's all the way north or something somehow, then that's not great. Odds are, though, it's close enough to Perth that going there is okay. Yeah, that's fine. That's good. Okay. Round number four. We can do this. Oh, this is really good to get. This should be San Marino. I think if it's not actually there, it'll be Italy close to it. So yeah, should be fine just clicking here. But super distinct landscape in San Marino. The, the Gen 2 coverage like this in this kind of road is very much so a thing there. Yeah, that is good to get. Again, the small countries, you'll love to see them in Henge. And the last one, another good one to get, Taiwan. So we are guaranteed safe. We just click right there. And that is beautiful. All right, head streak of four. So far, we haven't missed yet. I'm worried that we're going to get a Russia round where I'm not as sure, or an Australia round without obvious metas. So let's keep on going to our fifth game and keep this streak alive. Okay, here we go. Oh, I think we're back in Indonesia. Ooh, not sure what any of that is. Anything helpful? It's a, a sack of nitrogen. At least we know for sure it's Indonesia, tells us there. Yeah, this one is not as clear to me. Not immediately just Java, although it, it might just be there. I mean, again, it's safe. Probably just safe to go Java. I might just accept the loss here, lose some points. It is Java. I'm on the wrong side again. Damn it. All right, next round. Here we go. Keeping it up. Oh, this is beautiful. Somewhere in Europe. Seems... Oh, that's interesting. Planted palm trees here. We do have language. I was going to say Austria, but that is more Slovenian, I guess. Yeah, they can look pretty similar, and with the language, I trust that we're there. Again, it should net us a good amount of points. Yeah, very nice. Okay, round number three. Ah, oh, South Korea. Love to get these smaller countries. This is beautiful, so we just dive on hedge there. That is perfect for me. Next one. Ooh, do we have baller? Do we do? What is that? Is that a Danish baller? It's kind of far away. It's hard to see. It's actually maybe too hilly to be there. Just a little bit. Yeah, something feels wrong for that. I don't think this is Denmark. What will this be, though? Something... Maybe it's a Belgian baller, because they, I guess, can kind of look similar sometimes. Maybe? <laughs> I, I don't know. I, I'm not sure what's going on here. I might take the loss in this one. 
It is down. Oh my god. <laughs> I thought it was too hilly, but 3400 isn't terrible. I mean, we should be okay. Hilly Denmark trips me up too much, and the last round here we should be okay. Let's see. 16-6, depending what this is. Oh, what is this? Oh, it's the Philippines driving on the right. Yeah, concrete road. Okay. So we need, what, 3400 points? So I don't think Middle Philly guarantees that it might guarantee it but we gotta try to have a good guess here anything anything in these businesses at all Yanera branch that actually might be our town okay I see that twice now yeah do we look for that uh where is this gonna be I have no clue honestly is it south see I'm worried it's just a small town and it won't show up or it's like a neighborhood of some city something like that I, I'm not seeing it uh, what do I do do I hedge Panay isn't that gonna get me 34 I'm worried it won't Odds are we should survive this, but it's a tough call. Let's, I'm just going to go. Oh, 38. It is up here. Oh, uh, yeah, that's a pretty small place. Okay, missed it there, but head streak of five again. We're barely surviving, but we are alive in any case. Next round right here. Let's keep it up, man. Here we go. Okay, this is Brazil. Oh, we haven't had Brazil yet today. This could be bad. Oh, I gotta try to make a good guess here. What is this gonna be? It feels more north with some of these plants and bushes. I don't know. I, I'm thinking Bahia, Tocantins, something in here, kinda. Brazil's really hit or miss for me. Sometimes I nail it, sometimes I just have no clue. This feels more like a no clue type around. Uh, I'm gonna go right there, though. Come on. It is north. Okay, uh, 32 isn't the worst. I, I can accept that. That's That's okay. Round number two. Okay, oh, it should be Europe here with that blue antenna gen 4. Got this uh, lady with a security vest biking down the road, hell yeah. Oh man, okay, I'm not sure what's going on here, to be honest. It feels... weird, I don't know, this is just nothing to me. Is it ever... just Baltic somehow? That can't be right. Europe isn't that huge if I go Lithuania and it's not there. It shouldn't be a huge disaster, but if it's way far away, disaster strikes. Ooh, 3k, not even, it's hungry. Oh, that ran through my head. Damn it, okay. Round number three, we're not doing good on this seed. We need a recovery. And don't tell me we're... No, this isn't... Is it... Wait, no, it's not Brazil again. <laughs> Hold on. The poles and architecture are like Nigeria, but this is just weird. I guess we're there. It seems like a Nigeria blur enough to me, so yeah, sure. I don't know where to go. Where do I go here? Do I go over there? I am confused on this. I, I guess that's my best choice. I'm not sure, man. It's up there. Ah, 4,300. Okay, we're above average here, but we're struggling. Round number four. We need good guesses here to end. Almost perfect scores. Crap, dude. Okay, this is New Zealand, I think. With these poles, yeah. Ah, uh, how can we do this? We got mountains up to their northeast here. Or like this. I feel like this is another round I've seen before. Okay, we gotta use these mountains. So we're in a pretty large valley here. Big mountain ranges up to the northeast and southwest of us. Can we see any water? Anything like that. Something tells me there's going to be water south over there. It kind of feels like it, but I'm not sure. So let's look at New Zealand, see where we can go. If we don't get like 4,700, we're done. I mean, maybe we're looking at the weird Christchurch mountain thing over there. I doubt it, though. With the way that's angled? No, that can't be. And then it gets more hilly up there. I mean, maybe it's North Island. Oh, man. Oh, man. What do I do? Less than 30 seconds, this is probably going to be it. It's over. I'm going way south. This is probably a terrible guess, but time is up. Got nothing left, so we'll see. Oh yeah, it's way north. That is that is sealing our fate there. All right, what did we get to? Five, I think. Not a terrible start. I just didn't play this seed very well. I should have gone more north in Brazil. Round two, I messed up. So yeah, fate was sealed there. Nothing else we can do except give this a second try and try to get over five. Here we go. Come on. We started out so strong. We got to keep that up. Keep the momentum going. Okay, we're back in Argentina, and in the mountains this time. Okay, anything on these walls that we can use? I don't think any of this stands out to me now. It doesn't seem familiar. Uh, in the mountains like this, though, this is feeling like... Somewhere like San Juan, close to there, you know. So I think going... Maybe, yeah, maybe just going San Juan. Maybe I go a little north, like La Rioja. And hopefully that's 3,500 at worst. We'll see. 42. That's good. Okay, we're above average. Round number two. Okay, what is this? Australia? Oh no. Oh no. Okay. <laughs> it feels southern, like Vic, close to South Australia, but not quite there because of the poles. 
I'm probably completely, completely wrong about that. I need to look at these trees more. You know, I don't... No, I don't like that anymore. I gotta go more north. I think it's more like up here. Just looking at some of these trees. Yeah, I can't bring myself to go there. There's no way. But up here maybe is better. Yes, it is there. Okay, good. Oh, I'm very happy with that. Not often I do well in Australia. Good stuff, dude. Next round, what do we got? Stock car horse. Oh, weird. Is this Luxembourg? It is. Helange. That's a, that's a town, right? That sounds familiar. I mean, Luxembourg is tiny, so it doesn't really matter, honestly. We just gotta go. There we go. Very nice. 4,900 points. Free rounds. We'd love to see that. Here's round number four. This is Senegal. Another pretty good one. This is deserty, so... Should be okay just going like Luga there. Oh my god. Let's go, dude. <laughs> it's actually Luga. Alright, this gets better. Round number five. Come on. Looks like we're ending with the UK. Yeah, yellow backplate, so with only needing 1,400 points, 13-something, we just go right in the middle there. And that works for me. Beautiful. 23 k it. That's a good sign for this attempt. So let's keep it up. Head streak of one. Four more to go to tie the best of today. Here we go. Okay. Ah, oh, Bangladesh. You love to see it. Now, I do want to try to just play this smart and see if there's anything telling us the city or anything, because I have been kind of rushing through these today. Yeah, I don't see anything. I don't read Bengali script. I'm looking for Latin, so I, I don't see it. All right, we can just hedge Dhaka then. That's that's good. Should be a good 4,000 at the worst. 47 is awesome. Round number two. What is going on here? Oh, we're in Italy. Italian plates. Once again, I'm going to look to see if there's anything for a city or a region, anything like that. Sometimes you get the nice Italian signs which have communes on them, but don't see that here. Cool tile mosaic there. We are in the mountains here, but this doesn't look very northern to me. It feels more south. So I'll go kind of north of Naples, maybe, and hopefully that's all right. Should be a decent hedge. That's yeah, more south. Okay, that's fine. 45 is great. Round number three. And looks like we're in the U.S. And we have these reflectors. Oh, man. Is that Oregon reflectors? I'm, rust I'm rusty at my U.S. stuff. I mean, it looks kind of like Oregon out, out east more over here. Best guess I have, to be honest. Let's see. Uh oh, it's California. Okay, <laughs> damn it. <laughs> oh, whatever. It's close to Oregon. We still got over 4K, so I'm happy. Round number four. This is back in Latin America. What is this, though? Is it Mexico? I think it's going to be Mexico. Yeah, there's Mexico. Okay. And a tortilleria, of course. All right. So <laughs> this kind of feels like just middle of Mexico to me with the landscape and everything. Yeah, I'd go Michoacan here. No, not at all. Okay, we're behind average there, but that's okay. One more round. We have over 17k, so we're chilling here. This is probably just the Netherlands. I want to make sure on the plates, though. Of course, we can't see them, but these houses look really Dutch. Yeah, this is Dutch. we got the bollards and a guy on a bike there. What more can you ask for? There we go, Netherlands. All right, head streak of two. So far, doing great on our second attempt. Here's round number three. Let's see what we get. Okay. Oh, oh Peru. Peru sign, Peru poles, and this is more tropical, so we gotta be careful, try to get the right area, because there aren't too many roads covered in the tropical parts of Peru, so we need to make sure we're doing this right. So this one's going northeast angled. San Ramon. That could be a town or something. We're still in the mountains, it's not like we've crossed over into the flat Amazon Valley, but still in the hills, so I'm gonna look really quick, why not, you know? See if we can find San Ramon or something. Yeah, I didn't see any center moans. It might just be a tiny village or not the place name at all, but I am going to stick there and hopefully not starting out badly here. Ah, uh, that's fine. 4,400. There's center moan. Okay, I definitely missed it then. Okay. Ah, uh, that's not bad. At least it is in the middle of the country, so a good score. Round number two. Okay. Oh, is this Brazil again? Okay. Ooh, tropical... Very mountainous as well. Really interesting. So the mountains of Brazil like this are all up and down the coast. And with how tropical it is, I feel like we're more north. Like maybe Espirito Santo, even in Bahia. This is another kind of weird round to me, though. I I am not sure, not confident at all. That's all I got is just somewhere there. Might be another round where I just accept my fate, lose some points if I'm not close. I'm moving a little more south. I just am not sure, man. Oh, it is here. Let's go. Okay. Oh, that's really good. One of my better Brazil guesses, actually. Very nice, man. All right, round number three. This could be the attempt. Come on. Or in Europe again, looks kind of not Czech. I was going to say Czech, it's Danish. Okay. <laughs> I'm kind of rusty at Europe, man. Especially urban rounds. No, this is definitely not the Czech Republic. Odin's, Odin's Edge. It's Germany. 
Wait. Oh, I'm so stupid, dude. I keep forgetting Germany exists. Was that German? I, I mean, surely it was. In my defense, it felt like Danish houses. We are North Germany, but that's there's no excuse for that. That's terrible. Again, though, doesn't matter on the country. We got over 4K, so I'm happy. This time... Oh, what's this language? That actually might be Czech. I think it is. Okay, really weird to get this right after. Yeah, that seems Czech. And dot CZ, good. Is Tisova the city or something? Maybe that's the, the trash company. <laughs> I probably just offended Simi and every other Czech in the community. I mean, I guess I just said to Prague here. It's a small country. And I'm gonna say decidedly that that was not the city name at all. But 4,600 points, we were doing quite well this game. Last round is Japan now. This should just be the man land somewhere. So, yeah, we'll, we'll get 1,700, right? Oh yeah, it's not even the main line, okay, <laughs> but it's fine. We got our points, head streak of three, we're doing all right here. Round number four, let's keep it up, man, here we go. Come on, let's at least get up to five and tie it. Oh, we got Australia, okay. Time to pull out some more Australia region guessing. This feels southwest with these kinds of trees, these like weird, I don't know what they're called, but this kind of tree. Now we actually, oh, we do have a, a clue, that's the South Australia gaps in the road, I think. Are those South Australia? I really hope so. <laughs> I've heard of this before. So now that we've seen that, I feel a lot better about this guess. So let's try to line up the road and go somewhere that makes sense. It's pretty flat here. I don't think we can see any water and it's more dry, more treeless. So we're not gonna be like way over here. You know, something like in there feels good to me. One of these types of roads. Yeah, I think I might just hedge it there. But that's pretty solid actually, very happy with that. Glad I cut the gaps in the road or I might have gone west. All right, round number two, we are in Mexico. We got Mexican bollards here and this landscape. Oh, okay, this could be bad. Some mountains here to the west, big divided highway. There's a town name here, but I can't read it. It's probably just a tiny place. Okay, okay, let's think. So let's first line up the road, see what direction we're going. We're going like this. Now at first I was kind of thinking we're up here somewhere close to Monterey, Texas, all this kind of area, but I don't know if the mountains really make sense. I mean, maybe we're right at the fringes of the, the Monterey Mountains? No, they, we have to have mountains closer to us west if we're there. I mean, I, there's like something there, but it doesn't seem very tall. And then south, I don't see any. It's really just up here. I don't know. Maybe I, I, I can't leave it there. <laughs> that doesn't make sense. What do I do? What do I do, man? I don't know. Maybe I go there. Just right in the middle. I'm gonna hedge, honestly. Yeah. That actually, that works. Okay, it's actually in the middle, awesome. Yeah, the landscape was definitely not right to be there with the mountains as well, so I'm glad I caught myself, moved over there, and that worked out for the better in the end. Round number three, so far we're doing pretty well. This is very interesting. Big truck of logs there. What in the world? I'm driving on the left. Is it Indonesia? I guess the pole is kind of Indonesia. Where would this be though? One of the nooses or something? Or something over here, Sumba? I don't know. It's just weirdly dry and sandy here, which generally I associate with over there, but uh, who knows. I'm gonna go Sumba. This probably makes no sense, but whatever, dude. Oh god, that's terrible. Really couldn't be worse. 1400. That hurts, but we should be okay. We gotta do a lot better now. Yeah, close to perfect for these last two, but hopefully we'll be okay. This should be Hungary with these poles and architecture, so hopefully Hungary helps us out. But let's try to have a good guess in Hungary, because if we're really far away... Then we could lose a lot of points. Too many for comfort in round five. I feel like something makes me want to go close to Romania, but that's really risky to do that. I have to just middle hedge it here. And hopefully that's okay. That's good. 47 is good. Last round, so we need 4,500. And wouldn't you know it, it's Australia. Two rounds to do this. Tatura, Rushworth Road, come on. I don't want this to be the last one. What is Rushworth? I don't know Australian plates either. Crap, dude. Oh. Poles, poles, what is that? Oh, where's Rushworth gonna be? Is this just New South Wales or something, like in here? I have to just scan for Rushworth. I, there's nothing else for me to do, really. I, this landscape just isn't distinct to me. I'm not good enough in Australia. No, this can't be the end. The pole, the pole is just... I don't know. Is that a Vic pole? I just don't know these things. Rushworth, no way, no way, no way, no way, it's here. Oh my god, this isn't gonna be the end. What do we have? We have the Federation Park here, come on. Lions Park, I don't believe I got it. 
Oh, it's Victoria. Okay, I was about to look at the whole wrong places. I'm really, really glad that I looked in Victoria. Living to see another round. Let's go to it. Game five. Can't believe I found it. Oh my god. Okay, here we go. Gotta stay focused. Hentian Tom Yum. Uh, it's Malaysia, I think. Yeah. Should be. Oh yeah, there's a sign. I wish you could see that, but Gen 4 Malaysia is only going to be on the peninsula, so that should net us 4k. If we go right in the middle, just by Koala. Yeah, that's fine. 43. Okay, round number two. Come on. Oh no, not India. Don't do this to me. Okay. Oh, I don't know India. India is something I really need to learn for Hedge. Because it shows up a fair bit on Improved World. Oh man, okay. I don't think it's very north. I don't think it's way south either. It feels like just over here, close to Hyderabad to me. That's That'd be my guess to Langana. There's probably going to be some meta here. Maybe the sign or poles or something. Dusky would know. But yeah, I'll go. I'll go to Langana. That's, that's not terrible, I guess. It's almost 4k. I'll take it. I'll take it. I can't complain about that guess. Really no room for me to. Round number three. Wow, beautiful mountains and vineyards here. And sun is in the north. I'm thinking this is Cape. Western Cape, uh, South Africa. Somewhere in here. Yeah, that, that feels right. Big vineyard area, these mountains. Sun in the north. Gen 2 coverage on this dirt road. Feels right to me. I'm gonna go for it. Beautiful. Two more rounds here. Come on. Oh, US, I think. Okay, this can be tricky. Let's try to not mess up here. Seems New Mexico, first thought. That's what I thought first. It could be Texas. I don't think it's California, because the polls aren't right, and it's also, you know, a little bit weird. More of the New Mexico, Texas type of plains area like out here. Yeah, that's that's really all I've got on this, so let's see. Ah, oh, just over the border in Texas. That's good though. 44. Alright, hopefully we survive this. This is oh amazing. We are in American Virgin Islands, US Virgin Islands. Whatever it's called. One of these places, I think. Oh, I messed it up. Oh no, I don't believe it. Oh, you idiots! We had a Colombian cross too, didn't we? Oh my god, you idiots! That hurts. I shouldn't have missed that. I really shouldn't have, but that is what I get for rushing, thinking that I know what I'm doing. Oh my god, dude. That is all for this head streak attempt. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I had a lot of fun trying this. Let me know if you want to see this again in the future. Make sure to give this video a like and subscribe so you don't miss the next one, and I will see you guys in the next episode.